Are you seeing small specks, blobs, lines, or cobwebs swimming around in your vision? How about flashing lights in your side vision? Flashes and floaters are very common as we age. So what causes them? And when should you be concerned? Keep watching. Hi, I'm Dr. Bill Benevento from Eye Surgeons Associates. Let's talk about flashes and floaters. Flashes and floaters are usually caused by something called a posterior vitreal detachment. This happens to almost everyone between the ages of 40 and 80. It's when the jelly that fills the back of the eye, the vitreous, shrinks and peels away from the back of the eye, getting replaced by some fluid. As the jelly peels away, it can tug on the light-sensitive layer, the retina, and tickle it a little bit, causing flashing lights that usually last a couple of seconds. Floaters happen when there are little densities on the back face of the jelly. These swish around in your vision and can look like cobwebs or a bunch of little specks or blobs floating around. Frequently, you'll see them when you look at a bland background like the sky. For most people, the jelly separates from the light-sensitive layer easily and nothing happens. But sometimes there's a sticky spot between the jelly and the light-sensitive layer, the retina, and as the jelly peels away from it, it can tug so hard that it can tear it. If this happens, fluid can get behind the tear and peel it off the back of the eye. This is called a retinal detachment and you really don't want one because it usually takes surgery to fix it. But if you catch a tear early, we can laser around it, welding it to the back of the eye so no fluid gets behind it. So if you get a bunch of flashing lights, a shower of the main little floaters all at once, or a dark black curtain coming into your side vision, you need to call us right away. It's much better to catch a tear early so we can laser it and prevent a detachment. Again, the vast majority of people don't get tears, but you don't know until we look. Frequently, the flashing lights go away with time, especially as the jelly fully peels away from the back of the eye. You might still get a flash every so often, especially in a dark room. When you get in the middle of the night, you look off to the side, the jelly bangs against the eye while you get a little flash. The floaters really never go away, but again, they may sink to the bottom of the eye or come further forward out of focus, so you don't notice them so much. And even if they don't, the brain is pretty good at ignoring things that don't really matter, and they become less noticeable with time. Some folks have flashing lights with their migraines. In fact, some folks just have the visual symptoms without the headache at all. These are called ocular migraines or acephalgic migraines, which literally mean migraine without the head. These look like heat waves or looking through water. Uh, a lot of times it looks like you're looking through a kaleidoscope. The kicker here is that they usually last longer, say 15 to 45 minutes, and are usually in both eyes. These are pretty common and frequently confused with flashes and floaters, but really have nothing to do with retinal tears. Again, if you notice a bunch of flashing lights, a shower of a million little floaters, or a dark black curtain coming to your side vision, you should really call us immediately. It's usually not a big deal, but if it is a new tear, an ounce of prevention is really worth a pound of cure. Thanks for watching our FYI series.